All right, uh, we're going to teach you right now how to put timing on your machine and also in case if a piece of thread get stuck in your hook. So, this is what you do. You're going to remove number one, your foot, your plates with two screws. And then you remove those screws also from your feeders. And now you can see your hook as you see over here. You have to move also the bobbin case which this is the bobbin case. Sometime when you get the machine and you try to install and a piece of thread getting into that base right here inside. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you timing number one, how it looks timing. So you're gonna turn, you're gonna turn your wheel, the needle goes gonna down, and then when it starts coming up, as you see, it will go into the groove Right here, it's a groove above the eye of the needles. All right, so this is on the time correct. It will go down, coming down, start coming up. This is the groove right there, daylight. You see, not pushing the needle and not open, right here. All right, so sometimes you have a problem which nothing move mean you have piece of thread inside the base right here so the best way to do is is turn the wheel right here and you see over here is a finger holding that base you can release that screw over here that screw and you take this little screwdriver you put it inside here the base and slowly you move it slowly slowly don't press on it too much because it could break just slowly you hold the hand wheel right here you hold the hand wheel like that and you turn this one back just press down slowly to release the thread inside then after just put your finger back and that's where it's supposed to be. Right here is a spot for the finger have little piece sticking out, supposed to go in and then you tie the big screw. And then the machine gonna move. When the machine doesn't move like that, you will see a thread inside. If you release that screw, you take this down, the finger, and then you see everything turning together, but the base doesn't. That's mean you have to add a new hook. And that's the only way to release it, to remove that finger, to stick a small screwdriver in here, and go slowly back and forth with that to see which way is gonna go easy. Put a little bit drop of oil, and you're gonna be okay. You can move it. Thank you very much from Atlas Levy Sewing Machine Company.